I'd like to start by saying uh, thank you to uh, Helen Minogue for being part of um, assembling us all together here. Helen is actually my introduction to Hoboken politics, having knocked on my door oh so many years ago. Thank it's it's got to be over 25 years, right, Helen? <laughs> I, I actually remember the first three politicians who knocked on my door. Helen was the first. Um, Anthony or Tony Romano was the second, and Tom Newman was the third. Tom Newman is truly an inspiration for me in molding my political views, and I want to thank him for that. I want to give you a bit of a background on where I came from, where I'm trying to go in the political arena. Uh, for a good 20 years, I've been involved in areas outside of what we call politics. Uh, mostly I've been involved in my uh, house of worship, uh, having run that organization, create that organization, expand that organization. I've also uh, uh, helped create, actually initiated, the creation of a preschool in that, in, in, in that environment. Um, I got interested in politics because I felt that Hoboken politics is rough, it's tumble, and it's not giving us the solutions we want or the solutions we need. Uh, I, my, my view on that has not really changed. I believe that the current mode of politics in Hoboken is, uh, is in a stalemate and it's not forward looking. If you think that this is where we are, this is where we need to be, folks, I'm not the solution for you. If you think Hoboken has better days ahead, different types of politics, progressive politics, politics with a vision, consider me. Thank you.